Many of the images and content you're about to see are unsettling and very shocking. But the most shocking thing of all is that teens everywhere are watching these images and are calling it entertainment. Remember that smell going up your nose, getting stronger and stronger as you think about it, more and more putrid, more and more foul. Getting stronger and stronger, and oh my God, it's coming from the person next to you. Open your eyes, it's coming from the person next to you. Yuck, 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 yuck. What's wrong, Bo? His underarms. <laughs> What's it like to you, Betty? Can't piss. Can't what? Piss. Can't piss. <laughs> Welcome to the Strange Tape Strange Show. This is episode number six. And today we're just going to be catching up on some mail. Uh, we're going to be watching some clips together. But before we dive in, I just... Oh my God. It's Dick Whittington, everyone. Uh, welcome to the show, Dick. We're big fans. We actually featured one of your tapes on episode one of our show. I haven't eaten for days. I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing here? I've been in London for three days. I've come from the country to look for work. Well, this isn't London, Dick. This is Chicago, and, you know, good luck finding work, but... I haven't eaten for days. Yeah, you mentioned that. Um, sorry to hear that. You know what, Dick? Why don't you stick around and kind of be my co-host this time around, and we can watch clips together. How's that sound to you? Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, it's working out after all. We are going to be together. Why don't we dive on in? We're going off on a great adventure. I haven't eaten for days. All right, I just want to give a quick shout out to our friend out in Michigan by the name of Tony. He goes by at Phony Fresh on Instagram. He's a great guy and sent a very generous package, including fake kitty crap, a tape called X Mates. Wakeboarding and BMX, hot nude all girl action sports. Looks like a good one. I'd share a clip if I knew how to pixelate stuff. Sturgis 93. Vitamix cookbook video. I haven't eaten for days. Sensual reality. Bathe your mind in erotic, intense, uninhibited cyber sex. Sensual reality. And last but not least, Certainly not least, how to have cyber sex on the internet. It's a very popular video nowadays. So I was excited to see that in there. So thank you again, Tony, for the awesome package. This one is long overdue. It's from our buddy out in California by the name of Corey. He sent this a while back and we're finally getting around to it. Thank you, Corey. It's a, a movie called Runaway Truck. It's from 1988. It's like a kind of homemade quality, uh, low budget movie made by these guys that were workers at a Tower Records, an early Tower Records out in Sacramento. There's some awesome footage of like, the, I don't know if it's the video area of Tower or if it's actually a Tower video store. Let's check it out. Oh, man, wait up a minute, man. I put my hand in a pile of bird shit. Oh. All right, thank you again, Corey, for introducing us to Runaway Truck. What do you think of Runaway Truck, Dick? Oh, it smells so good. Well, moving on, we got another package from our friend out in Oklahoma by, na by the name of Rod Lott. He goes by at Flick Attack on Instagram. He does a movie blog called FlickAttack.com. He's an awesome writer, and he used to do, actually do a a zine in the late 90s, early 2000s called Hitch, and he sent a big stack of uh, back issues of Hitch. It's a super fun pop culture and movie zine, so thank you for that, but the real icing on the cake, he sent this tape, 
it was like a companion to a zine, uh, Hitch Found Footage Volume 1. And this thing is, this is the master tape. It doesn't have a cover or anything. This is the master tape. He used to make mixtapes off of this tape. And uh, it used to be available through a zine. So I posted on our YouTube channel this weird blockbuster training video. Freeze, sucker! You can watch that on our channel. That's from the Hitch found footage tape. There's a lot to choose from, but I picked out a, a clip that I particularly enjoyed. Let's check it out. What does it feel like to get sprayed with oleoresin capsicum? Scott, I've been sprayed dozens of times, and I can tell you what it's like to be sprayed, but you won't believe it unless you see it. So why don't we go outside, spray me, and you can see exactly what this stuff does. I think we can all agree that this is the best part. John, where's the water? Thanks again, Rod, for the awesome mail. And last clip I have as far as new mail is concerned. Tape from our buddy out in Washington State again. Great guy who has been also very generous by the name of Taylor. He goes by at Video Arena Archives on Instagram. He sent this tape, safety shorts, amputation injuries. It's a very short tape. It's only four minutes long. It's like a training safety video. It is a little gory, so be warned. I actually edited out a good portion of the gore, but there's glimpses of it. But what you're really looking for is the acting in these videos. It usually starts with a bad idea, like the idea to go out and mow the front yard barefoot. prompt and effective first aid before transport to the hospital. But the type of first aid depends in part on the type of the amputation. Massive tissue damage can cause these wounds to bleed profusely. Direct pressure is the best way to control that bleeding, but it must be very carefully applied to avoid damaging still connected tissue or worse yet, completing the amputation. All right, that last clip was from a tape called Psychology Today. It's by a group called Extreme Animals. They're like a music group slash video art group. I got this tape from a label actually called Random Man Editions on Instagram. It's incredible stuff. It's really interesting, you know, tripped out, crazy music, crazy visuals. I can't recommend it enough. And that should do it. That's the show for today. I guess before we go, there is one last thing. Dick wants to take us out on on a, on a clip from one of his favorite VHS tapes, he said it's his favorite tape of all time and it'd be a great way to end the show. So Dick brought in this tape. It's called Natural Wonders of Europe, The Most Beautiful Shores of Europe. It's really good. You'll like it. All right.
When the Mistral or the Tramontana winds weren't blowing too hard, I would settle myself down between two rocks at the water's edge and might stay there almost the entire day in that kind of stupor and delicious despondency that comes of contemplating the sea. That was a terrible clip to end the show on, Dick. I haven't eaten for days. Until next time, keep it strange. Freeze, sucker! John, where's the water? Ah! 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 A pile of bird shit. Delicious despondency. Sensual reality. Control that bleeding. I haven't eaten for days. Sturgis 93. Cookbook video. Meet our president. Thank you very much. Bathe your mind.